Two CFA volunteers have been praised for their role in saving a driver from a burning wreck. As Seb Costello reports, the car crash landed in their front yard after flying at least three metres in the air. Waking to a burning wreck in their front yard, this pair of part-time firefighters sprang into action. Couldn't really hear him yelling with the flames coming from the bonnet, but he was honking the horn and banging on the window. James grabbed the garden hose. It's not been done before and normally... You know, you're using a 38 mil hose off a fire truck, so it's a lot more pressure. While Adam went for the driver. But he managed to get his seatbelt off, move his seat back and get one foot into the passenger well before I managed to grab him and pull him out of the car. With two broken bones in his neck, Dave Logan was nursed by a neighbour. Made sure he was comfortable and waited for the ambulance to get there. The 26-year-old's car had spun off the road, launching off a concrete fence and into the air. These tree markings give you an idea of just how high in the air the Commodore wagon was when it came flying through James and Adam's front yard, spinning a number of times before crashing and bursting into flames. Police were impressed by the life-saving duo. They've done a sterling effort coming out and doing what they've done. They, they haven't hesitated or panicked at all. And though cool in the crisis, the boys did admit that even they were caught off guard just for a second. The first thing I thought is... You know, it's a car, you know, in the driveway, what do I do? But then we had our heads back down to level and figured it all out. Alcohol and speed will be investigated. Seb Costello, Nine News.